Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Chrissy. If you're new, thank you so much for joining us. I have two little girls, Shukri Marie and Layla, and they have made a huge mess, a huge daily mess out of their toy room and playroom. So today I'm gonna go ahead and tackle it, get it out of the way and start rearranging, organizing, cleaning and decluttering. Surprise! This video right here is going to be an Organize My Life series. This is part one of a five part Organize My Life video series of organizing all things around your house. We're going to be doing the playroom and underneath the kitchen sinks, the master bathroom and guest bathrooms. So as I'm cleaning, I discovered all of these arts and crafts little puffs that are all over the place and they always get stuck in the vacuum. Uh, my lucky perfume cap is under here. I'm trying to be quiet because the babies are sleeping. What is all of this? And then I look up here and I discover rock hard bitten up pieces of baby bell cheese. So I am just amazed at everything I'm finding. I've been looking for this Essie Bright White Fingernail Polish for the longest time. Had to stop for a little water break. Have to stay hydrated while you're moving. So you can clearly see that I am well on my way to picking up most of the stuff and moving it out of the room before I wake up fresh in the morning. I got all of the stuff that was out here out. At first I started organizing it and then I just said, you know what, right now, since it is so late, I'm going to just get everything, put it in piles, and then worry about organizing it tomorrow. Going to bed and gonna continue tomorrow. But I have to wake up super early tomorrow, hopefully before the babies wake up. That's just not gonna happen because they both wake up early, so. <sighs> See you guys tomorrow. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to day number two of the reorganizing, and decluttering, cleaning, and switching up the furniture of the girls' toy room. Clearly, the girls have been in here. <laughs> okay, so both girls are occupied. They're eating snacks and watching a little cartoons. So here I go. Let's get started. I am busting out my Method Anti-Back in the Wildflower scent. I really cannot stand that scent. I ordered the Bamboo and the Wildflower from Grove Collaborative. I couldn't remember which scent I hated, but it ended up being that Wildflower. Right there, the one in the purple bottle. Ugh, I just don't like it. I know a lot of people like it, but I don't. So anyways, I'm wiping everything down and I'm taking out all of the cubbies and just trying to clean up and organize everything. wondering about our little white and yellow table that's in the toy room um, a few months ago before I had moved to Tri-Cities my mom had FaceTimed me from a small vintage shop locally in Tri-Cities and she said oh my god I fell in love with this table it'll be perfect in your toy room and blah 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 she FaceTimed me I fell in love with it also so it is super cute it's just um, the yellow sticks out like a sore thumb in the house so I need to find the time to sand down the yellow paint and paint it white or gray. In case anyone's wondering about my table, because anytime anyone comes over, they always have something to say about my table. So that's the story behind our little yellow wooden table. 
So now I'm going to take the four that were here and put them over here. I have new tape for the remaining four. Okay. I should do one here. Hi. And one here. Or again, like this and this. I decided instead of these baskets, I'm going to put these galvanized metal P-L-A-Y play letters up on this wall right beneath the window in the playroom. Perfect area. If anyone's on the fence about command strips and hooks, they really, really work. They didn't scuff or chip any paint from my wall. Here I am assembling two IKEA spice racks and using them for bookshelves for Layla's new books that she got for her birthday. So now it is time to organize everything. And my biggest concern that I normally have in their toy, toy room is majority their Melissa and Dub toys. So all of their Melissa and Dub toys are right here. And I am steadily finding more throughout the house. So yeah, I'm just going to organize all of these and then I'm going to organize all of their piggy bank and their music maker and their teapot and all that stuff. starting to open some of the packaging from Layla's first birthday and putting the stuff together, putting batteries in some of the things and using an electric drill to put some of the stuff together. A day and a half two days the toy room is finally finished organized decluttered and rearranged and now we have a stash for um, flashcards that we're gonna be getting into soon the earlier the better it's never too early to start 
here is the kitchen everything is nice and organized we have sugar cookies and sandwich stuff in there we have a princess birthday cake in that drawer we have the eggs in the microwave there's sliceable fruits up on top of the microwave there's canned goods and cupcakes and brownies there's some miscellaneous things some hot dogs and pieces of butter and bacon and fish and things like that there's some donuts down there there are some things that we're still finding throughout the house there's some bread we really really love and enjoy Melissa and Doug There is some books. There's Layla's new books that she got from Uncle John Ross, Auntie Morgan, and Cousin Jordan. There is Legos. There's some wooden blocks over there, baby toys and miscellaneous. And here is more books in stackable colors in the walking alphabet dog. There's our silly little yellow table. There's Miss Layla. She really likes that yellow chair that Cousin Tasia got her. And Shukri Marie really likes the tea set. It's actually a pretty cool tea set. Anyways, the kids are having so much fun. And they love it. They really appreciate a good cleaned room. There is a happy birthday picture of both of the girls on Layla's birthday. Yeah, super impressed with the toy room. I love how everything looks and everything is easily reachable for the kids. If I can give you one advice in organizing a playroom, it definitely, definitely, definitely would be organizing bins. That is it for our toy room organization, declutter, rearrangement, and cleaning of it. We got rid of so much stuff. Definitely happy in here. Layla really seems to like this alphabet potty chair that she got from her cousin Tasia. Hi, give me a kiss. And Shukri Marie really likes Layla's um, teapot set. Please come back, like, and subscribe this video if you want to see more. This is going to be part one of a four or five part Organizing My Life series. I feel really comfortable starting the series in this room. It really motivated me to get the rest of my house done. There's going to be the playroom like we did today, and there's going to be linen closet organizations, master bath and guest bathroom organizations, under the kitchen sink organizations, and maybe one or two other vlogs of organizations. So again, thank you so much for watching, and we will see you guys next time. Bye! Bye-bye! Oh!